Hello everyone and welcome. It's me, Bryson P, and today is package day. That's right, we got a package. But because I was in Denver all last week, we didn't just get a package. Hold on. That's right. We got two packages. So this one right here is from Norway, and this one right here is from Australia. So if you want to see the one from Australia, I have the link up here for you to click on and you can go see the one from Australia. But I'd like for you to see the one from Norway first, and then the one from Australia. So we're going to put the one from Australia back down here. And we're going to find out what we got from Norway first. Hopefully this time we can open the package a lot easier than last time. And I think we will. I'm not going to act like a wild animal. I'm going to try and do this somewhat appropriately here. Y'all said that on the post Nord box there was an easy way to open it compared to the way I did it. So, I just want to make sure before I do. Ah, there's just some tape. Yep. Awesome. And this is from Maria. So, Maria, thank you greatly, beyond greatly. I just want you to know that before I even get in here. That whatever is in here, even if it was a box of snakes, I appreciate the fact that you sent it to me. If it was a box of snakes, though, I hope they'd be dead by now. All right, let's see what we got. Oh, boy. All right. First things first, we got a mini mouse pad, and it is a Northern Light Magic, Arctic Light Magic. Ooh, okay, check this out here. It is a mouse pad, and guess what? Hang on, I guess this is the mouse pad I've been using. Been using just this old blue one, so it's gone now, and I now have a mouse pad to use in place of it. So, cool, Let's set that right there. And we got a book about the Aurora Borellis, the Northern Lights, as the easy way to put it, which is really neat. Oh, look, and this is the first page I opened it to. Check that out. All righty, wow. So now I got a book from Sweden about Sweden, and now I got a book about the Northern Lights. Awesome. All right, let's see what else we got. We got a 48 piece, cool, the polar bear cub travel puzzle. Check that out, right? This is really neat because I, I'm gonna give this to my, I'm gonna give this to my kids because my kids absolutely love puzzles. And this is something neat that I can tell them was sent from Norway and just for them, that's awesome, thank you. Oh, wow. Like the first three things I pull out are just all three cool. We got a um, Norwegian Kit Kat. Not funny. <laughs> it's not. It's not a Norwegian Kit Kat. It's, it is, but it's not. You know, I know not to call it a Kit Kat because you guys don't like to, you know, call it a Kit Kat because it's not. It's not. Cool. I can't wait to try it and give you my, my thoughts on it. <clears throat> Okay, let's try this. Let's try this for the third time, okay? So, in my first one from Sweden, I freaked out about the fact whenever I realized that these were cars, not just cars on the end right here, okay? So, then in my previous video, I pronounced it Bilar. So, let's try this again here. We got a pack of Bilars, right? A pack of Bilars. And I did eat all the ones that were sent to me from Sweden, so I would definitely be eating these as well. And my kids didn't like them. We got... However you want to pronounce this. Lebon? Lebon? Uh, Din Original. So, if I have to guess, I'm going to say, based on the looks, these are sour, right? If I had to think about it, just based on what I'm seeing. And it looks like they come in pineapple, orange, green apple, raspberry, lemon. And then that's, oh, wait, 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 wait. Soft jelly women and jelly men rolled in sugar. Oh, so they're not, so they're not sour, Okay, cool. I'm going to try these out here in a second. We got us a can of Mac Rule. 
can of mackerel. I wonder if I should open this in here. What else the next time we got? Some hand cream. Some concentrated, unscented, instant relief of dry, chapped hands in just a drop by Neutrogena. I can use that. What else we got here? There's all kinds of neat little stuff in here. Let's see what this is. Oh, it's a coffee mug. And it is not broke. Now, how do you know that I like coffee mugs? Because I actually do have coffee mugs that um. Uh, they're put up right now because I live in a garage, in case you didn't know. My coffee cups that I've collected over the years from places I've traveled and whatnot. Um, yeah, I have. So this right here adds to it already. And it's got northern lights on it. Look at that. It's not broke. It's not chipped. It's not cracked. It's in great condition all the way from Norway. And it has the northern lights. Look at that. Check that out here. Boom. Isn't that great? Isn't that fantastic? Cool. Uh, oh, there's a kid on it. I don't know. Um, lever, lever paste? So is it... Let me put my thinking cap on. I can't read none of it. I see salt. Well, I have no clue what this is. Oh, boy. Uh, little flag. Little Norwegian flag. <laughs> That's, um... I got a magnet. Yes, it is a magnet. Cool. I do like magnets. I can't turn the camera around, but I have another board behind me that's got a bunch of magnets and stuff on it. So I also collect the magnets. And we got another magnet from Norway. This one is more about the Northern Lights. Awesome. What else we got? What is this? Super Salt Hockey Pulver. I have no clue what this is, but it says Super Salt. Oh, and there's powder. Listen. Yeah. We're going to find out what this is. Thing of... Norwegian chocolate hearts, it looks like. If I had to guess and assume that they are, yes, they are. Milk chocolate, as I believe what it says. Awesome. Got some milk chocolate hearts from Norway. And we got a kick. My soft licorice toffee. The original since 1954. That's almost as old as my truck. I got a truck sitting out here that's a 1950. So, awesome. We got another kick, and this one is sea salt. So that one was original. This one is sea salt. Okay. Ooh. And this one got a little, a little funky, but it's okay. This is milk chocolate as well. Sweet, and I can't wait to taste it. Man, y'all are sending some amazing things. This is all fantastic stuff. Look, and we got a note and a card. Sweet. All right, we can put that box on over there. Okay. Um, we are going to check out our card here from Norway first. Hi, Bryson. Here are some Norwegian food and snacks. Enjoy. I've written down some facts about them so you know what to expect. Thank you, because I have no clue what to expect. Stay. I look forward to every video you make. They are truly, I'm sorry, they are really good. You are so down to earth, positive, and humble. Keep up the good work. Greetings from Maria. Gotcha. Awesome. Thank you so much. Cool. Now, the reason for this, if you've noticed the last few videos, is so that way... I now have a place for all the... Now we have one from Norway. So let's find out what kind of foods and stuff we got here. Foods and snacks. Solo is a Norwegian orange soda that was launched in 1934. Sorry, forgot to put it in the box. It's okay. It's okay. And then we got the lever, lever postai, which is this right here with the girl on it. 
We have that. It is made of liver. That's what I was thinking. I was thinking it was paste of liver, but I don't know. Let me read. It's eaten on bread and very popular among children. Right, liver? Am I reading? Is that correct? Anyway, put in the refrigerator a couple hours before tasting. Okay. I guess like I'll have to do with the uh, salted patroner is I'll have to put this in the refrigerator for a few hours and make a secondary video where I actually try this. And I will try this, since it says to eat it with bread, I will try it on some of my dried, crispy, crunchy, crumbly rye bread that I got from Sweden. So, awesome. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Mackerel and tomat. Right? However, oh, okay. I got you right here. All right. Is mackerel and tomato sauce. Yep, you either love it or you hate it. We eat it on bread. Keep it in the refrigerator. Okay, so I'm going to make a secondary video then for this as well. Or I'm going to put both of these in the refrigerator and try them, okay? Kick is soft licorice toffee. Yes, it is. The red one is sweet. The blue one is salty. Okay. And, ah, La Bam is soft jello men and women. They are stretchy and sweet. The yellow one is lemon. The green one is apple. The red one is raspberry. The orange one is orange. And of course, the dark green one is pineapple. Oh, okay. All right. And of course, this right here, the. Y'all want me to try it? The. Uh, Kvik, uh, I can't do it. I can't even try it. Okay, so anyways, the Kvik lunch is the chocolate we eat when we go hiking and skiing. Okay, never tell a Norwegian that it's like a Kit Kat. <laughs> and then we have the milk chocolate, which is the best chocolate in the world. Okay, and we got the Bilars, which are actually Swedish. Bilar means car. They are soft and sweet. We got the Hockey Polvar is really strong super salty licorice powder not many can handle it but i loved it as a kid the heart-shaped chocolates are milk chocolates enjoy this is so awesome i'm just i'm so humbled at this for real since last time i started with the salty 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 stuff is we're going to work our way up all right so thing we're going to do is we're going to try a little bit of this chocolate since it's supposed to be the best chocolate in the world and it says to open it like that, so I'm going to follow the directions here. No, I'm not. There we go. We got a little piece. So we'll try it here. Mm-hmm. That's some good chocolate. It definitely has a little bit different taste than the, the chocolate I got from Sweden. There's definitely a little bit of a, a, a... no. There's definitely a difference that I can taste, personally. Can't say which one I like better, because they're both delicious. Let's go to this one right here that I can't pronounce. And we'll see if mine has little kiwi birds on it that I was talking about. Let's see. They do have the little birds on it. And in case you don't know what I'm referring to, here. there's little birds on it. And they almost look like a kiwi bird to me from, like, New Zealand. Try a piece of it here. Hmm. That's better. Yeah, that's better than a Kit Kat. So this is definitely very good, and I would eat that for sure. Way over a Kit Kat. All right, now we got some Laban. Laban. We got a. Uh... Thank you for coming all the way from Sweden. You're welcome. Why'd you come from Sweden? You're supposed to come from Norway. Ding dong. Wow, those are definitely. Those are definitely very jelly. They're good. They're very, 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 very jelly. We don't need to try the Bilars. So. Let's just get right on down to it. How about that? Let's find out what this super salt hockey puck is and how it's going to um, make an effect here. How do we open? Oh, I think I'm getting it. Nope. Oh. Duh. Well, that didn't work very well. Here we go. So this is just straight up black licorice. 
like super salty licorice powder. Really strong, super salty licorice powder. Look at that. Like. So here's what we're gonna do, just because it's the way that I am. So we're gonna mix it up just a little bit. We're gonna take us a big old scoop of it here. No, I'm not about to put this knife in my mouth. You're crazy. But I'm just gonna let you see. You ready? That's definitely just like a crushed up salt of Patroner. Whoa, that's a rush, ain't it? Whew. Oh, you're shaking. <laughs> wow. Thank you so much, Maria, for sending me this all the way from Norway. It is amazing. I'm beyond grateful. So I'm going to go put these in the refrigerator. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, that's great. That's wonderful. Thank you. And if you didn't, that's okay. I might not be your flavor and might not be your style. Everyone's different. Everyone's welcome to feel how they want to. That's great about being an individual. So it's me, Bryson P. Have a great day, great night, whatever time you see this. Goodbye.